Hey, thanks for checking in the bathtub, sir. And I am currently in the tub with Ape out. And let me tell you, I'm so ready to go bananas to the sounds of jazz and violence. Now, Ape Out was released on the 28th of February 2019, and it is currently priced on Steam at £10.99. There is no sale at the moment, but who's to say that won't change in the future? It's developed, as you might have noticed in the bottom right there, by Gabe Cazillo, but Steam also credits Bennett Foddy and Matt Bosch as uh, developers as well. Now, obviously, seeing the name Bennett Foddy there instills a lot of confidence that this is going to be an amazing game, because I know him through getting over it with Bennett Foddy, as some of you might as well. It's also published by Devolver Digital, and so, I mean, second to maybe Chucklefish and Tiny Build, Devolver Digital, some of my favourite indie publishers. So I've got high hopes for Ape Out. Now, if I was to try and describe this game, it's going to be a super stylistic beat em up, smash em up, Hotline Miami esque, uh, running through chaos trying to get out, as you may have noticed in the title. I'm not sure if that long line of words made a lot of sense there. I think maybe it's best if we just jump in and see how this actually plays. Man, I'm loving the drum beats already. <laughs> Very percussion based, I think, this soundtrack. Oh, is that me? The hell? I look like a like a deformed chicken wing. Um, left stick, right trigger. Oh, whoa, okay, let's ape out, indeed. <laughs> a game by Gabe Cazillo, well done, Gabe. It's fun already. Ah, uh, Matt, Matt Bosch has done the sound. Cool. The subject four. And with art by Bennett Foddy, there we go. So that's how everyone comes together to make this game. Holy crap, this is an experience. Oh, I've just been shot. It's worth noting that the game is uh, ultra violent in a beautiful stylistic fashion. I'm seeing blood everywhere, but it's time for us to get out of here. We're in a maze. This poor, poor ape, he can't stay here no longer. Can I dodge or anything? Oh, two at a time. Smash through that, you can. <laughs> oh my god, it's beautiful. What's that? Is that a shard of glass? There's a door through there, okay. Let's go back around and get these suckers. Uh-oh. Is it walking? No! I'm dead! Already! Oh, we nearly made it to the end. We were so close. You can see our route. That is a great touch. Holy crap. Well, I guess you get an idea of what Ape Out is like then. Oh no, I've just noticed. There's uh, apes on either side of our ape, who from henceforth will be known as uh, Greg. And it seems that they're dead. Either that one's sleeping, or that one's very sad in the corner. So maybe that's why Greg, uh, Greg has finally seen it, enough is enough, and it's time to ape out of here. I want to get the scientist this time. Take that. Don't you dare try and shoot me. Right, let's just make it out. Oh, right stick aim. Left trigger grab. You can grab. Okay. Subject four. Was we subject three before? Oh! <laughs> okay, that's a cool way to play it. Man, there's hardly anything left of them once Greg gets a hold of them. There you go, dude. Oh, I love hitting them against the walls. Should we just try and get through this level? What's that? <laughs> Pull him down, eh? No, never. That. I wonder if there's parts of the environment you can interact with. I hope so. Yes, that's what I wanted to do. Get him to shoot their own buddies. Uh oh. Oh no, we'll be fine. Oh man, we just nearly got shot in the ass there. Is that the end? I think we made it through stage one. Two, heating up. Okay, we can do this, not a problem. Greg is fine under pressure. Left trigger, right stick. But what does right stick do? Oh, that aims when I grab him. Okay, of course it does. So let me find one to grab hold of. I'm gonna throw him into that. It looks like a saw blade almost. Keep shooting. Okay. Uh oh, I'm gonna die. Will you shoot again? Do you only shoot the once? I think you do. You get one shot. Right, let me try and grab a poor soul and throw him into there. No, you don't. Uh oh. No! Greg! Oh, that got a lot harder. We had so much further to go. I can't overstate enough how much. The art design and soundtrack is playing a part in the enjoyment of this game. It is incredible to look at. You can see for yourself. Oh, he has... Okay, he's got like an explodable pack strapped to his back. Okay, so we can knock him into other other enemies. Now we'll go sky high. Brilliant. 
dodge that, but hit him. Yeah, this is one of the most beautiful, coolest looking game I've ever seen. There we go. Pure carnage here by Greg. Right, who can I throw you into? Come on, someone show themselves. Oh, I'll throw you down there. You're wasting time. <laughs> it's great though, what an incredible idea. Well, that's one of the things I love about doing these in the tubs with, because we get to see so many different types of games. Oh, I mean, it just got blown up. It was right near the end as well. But carrying on from that point, one thing I love about doing in the tub with is that we get to see so many different types of games. And really, your imagination is the limit of what you can make here. What an incredible idea. <laughs> and it's been realised so well. And I'm pretty sure we can make it through the end of this level now. I've got to grips with it. The bomb pack dudes are kind of annoying. I need to maybe watch out for that last area. No, no, no. That was a close one. Okay, be careful. There we go. I think we made it. That's the end. The green door signifies the next level. Knock, knock. What do they do, these things? I need to try and realise. They look like saw blades, so I'm not sure if they are. Oh, okay. That was a very quick death. Oh, we made it further. Don't you shoot me, you son of a sod. There you go, I'm here. Okay, now on the map, I don't know if you can check the map while you're actually playing, but I kind of don't want to. Grab the left trigger. Okay. Because I thought I saw an icon, but it must be this. And we have the door. <laughs> Holy crap, that's amazing. I hope we get to do more of that stuff. Get away. Well, we did take a little bit of damage, but I think you'll be alright. Yes. You really got to think quick on your feet because if you run into about three or four enemies, you need to think of the best way to take them out without getting blown up and or shot. Oh, I love these doors. But it is very similar, kind of, in Hotline Miami. So as with Hotline Miami, I think you sort of die more often and plan out your routes more. Even though I've died a fair few amount of times in this, I feel like I'm just still winging it each time, just running through. I have no set path. That might change in later harder levels, but now it's fun just running around and absolutely pummeling these sacks. Okay, false alarm. I love the style of each level as well, how they each have their own names and that. Okay, will there be alarms now that we have to look out for? Like, is each level name um, indicating a potential mechanic that's going to be introduced? I don't know. Oh good, okay, we're doing just fine. What is that? Is that water? Oh crap, okay, they're all coming. That was very close. I thought I was too close to the explode radius of that dude. Turns out we was okay. Uh oh, but he does he throw bombs? No, okay. Yeah, he does. Oh no! Wow, we were ages away. The levels are getting a lot longer, aren't they? Compared to stage one. I absolutely love that touch of seeing how far you've come on the death screen. Oh crap! Oh no! Okay, I think I triggered an alarm by grabbing the door. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, we have. What the hell's going on here? Are they new enemy types? Yes. No! Things got very tough. So it seems if you trigger an alarm, things go absolutely crazy. Leave Greg alone! He's just a poor ape. He wants to escape. Oh no, all the doors are shutting after me. Are they like never ending? Okay, we better go then. Better go quick, Greg. Don't look back, don't look back. Is there gonna be stealth elements coming into this? <laughs> okay, we're alright. Oh, wide open area. Keep going, keep going. There's too many behind me. And now we have to start thinking about this because it's getting worrying. Don't you shoot at me. Crap. Oh, please make it through. You're doing so good, Greg. Yes, the end of the level. That was a tough one. Now it's a blue loading screen. It's got to be a good sign. End of side A. Oh, it's just like a an old record, an old jazz record. Side B. Okay, let's see what the B sides are like. Power down. We've got to shut this whole facility down. Free our ape brethren. I hope so. Greg has high aims. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. 
I love how even though the whole floor plan is uh, red now, the blood still shows up wonderfully. Get out of there, you big sack. I love the symbol crashes every time you kill someone. This is a great game. Yeah, pull that out. It's intuitive. I've never seen this before. You know exactly what you have to do. Now, what do I throw? <laughs> now, what do I do? <laughs> oh, okay. We're going stealthy. Oh, of course. We've taken out the power through that generator. So they can't see Greg. <laughs> oh, it's a nightmare for them at least. But we are in control. We are the apex predator. We are the warrior. We are the big furry ape ready to take life. I love how the colour schemes are. Fuck! I'm changing. Okay, I'm dead. Now we've got white and purple. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Oh, okay. Did take quite a lot of damage there. Can I pull you? Nope. Nice, man. It's repowering down. Long shadows. Alright, let's be sneaky. Sneaky Greg, the killer ape. Don't you worry about me. You won't see me anywhere. When you least expect it, I'll be bearing down on you. With my jaw wide open. Oh my god. And my hands ready to curl around your neck. Jesus quite I'm scaring myself with the one trying to describe Greg here. I'm in a bit of trouble. No, don't you shoot me. Oh! I've got to be close to death. One more shot, and I think be down to uh, time to put him down. Okay, good. I'm glad there's no bomb suckers in here. So it could really prove a problem. Oh no! But imagine if the game got like a proper labyrinth. You could get easily lost in here. I think I'm bleeding, yeah. That's shown by the purple trail behind me. Oh, I didn't even kill him, crap. Oh, there's the end. Get through. Ding, 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 ding. It's so fun. Let's see what ding, ding, ding has. Hello? I think we've healed up as well. There's no more blood. No! Oh, crap. Where am I? Through the glass. Okay, I kind of wish we put the generator back in. It's hard in the shadows. It's a long hallway. You better not be a boss room. Oh! Okay, cool. Seems like they heard me. Asked for the power to come back on. Keep running. Keep running. Yes. No. Yes. There we go. Nice to see the red blood of our enemies again. Can't catch me. We're Greg the freaking ape. Go out. Yes. Don't even try it, you big sacks. I'm a master at this game now. There's the end. Get through. Oh Blown out. Okay, I wonder how long this game actually is. Because if there's only two sides to it, this could be the end right here. Maybe 10 levels. Could be a fair guess. Oh, I thought it was going to get a shot off on me. Should I maybe try to grab more dudes? I mean, it's going okay what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, go down, go down. Get out of their door. We're in our way. In our way to freedom. Anyone here? Oh, I love how he moves. Look at him hips. Greg swaying hips. That's my favourite way to kill him. Oh, I need to. I wish I could get more shots with their guns. Yeah, look, I tried it too much. I'm gonna try and actually shoot them, but my aim is too bad. No, no. Oh, there's so many. <laughs> God, the floor has been coated red. Come around here, take that. Okay, where do I go? I'm kind of lost. Here we are. That's our route. Wait for it. Like you can shoot me. Here we go. This level's actually been so tough for me. I think it's the furthest I've got. Oh crap, didn't mean to throw that door so quickly though. The open spaces are not our friends. That's when I tend to take the most damage. But we are making some ground here. Oh, okay. Oh no. This kind of stuff again. Alright, the alarm's off. Or the alarm's on rather. <laughs> yes, okay. I love these sounds. Oh my god. No, don't die. No, we came so close. I think that was freedom on the other end of that. This level is impossible. I can't do it. Try as I might. 
give them a good go this time. Okay, get through here. We got. Oh, don't shoot me. Okay, good, good. But yeah, I, I can only imagine this is the last level or something because they've really gone for it. There's <laughs> so many enemies. The open space is what really gets us. I'm hoping maybe this attempt is looking quite good so far. Nope, crap. That was a close one. Get through there. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Kill him. Leave that dude there. Should be some red doors. Right, this is the bit I cannot do. Try as I might. Gotta get through it. Yes. Yes. Come on. This is a good attempt. My best attempt. Oh. Don't get shot. Don't get shot. Okay, open it. Open it. I don't know if this is the end. Just as far as I've gotten. <gasps> We're outside. We've made it. Into the jungle. Ape out. <laughs> yes. Oh man, what a ride. What an experience. Disc one end. Is, is that it for now? Is there more to this game? Subject 4, Deaths 29. Oh man, I'm pretty sure I only had about 10 before I got to that last level. 26 minutes and 31 seconds. We did it. That was Subject 4. Right, okay. So, Ape Out Disc 2. High Rise? Oh, so now we're on... Now we're going to be on like a, in a cityscape maybe. I've got to try this. Let's give it a go. What the hell is this? Are we in a lift? We must be. Do I do anything? Hi. Rise. Perfect. So this is going to be like some King Kong stuff. Oh no. This is Greg's cousin, Paul. They also call him. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. Okay. Let's get out of here. This is so good to see that there's like different... Discs, which are signifying levels, I guess. We're on floor 30. So we need to get down, do we? You can knock them out the windows. This game just keeps getting better. Seriously, it's the game that keeps on giving. Get away. Okay. Oh, this is so good. Okay, follow the stairs. Floor 29. Oh my god, so is there going to be 30 levels here to do? It's like an office building. Get away from me. Oh, we're so dead. Oh, we're doing alright. Has he got an army helmet on? I can't work it out. We're bleeding a little bit. We're only on floor 28 now. We've got to find a lift or something. Crap. This is it. It's over. I want to knock him out the window, though. That's the funnest part. <laughs> okay, good. Keep going. 27. Come on. Right, again. Let's pull in similar tactics and hug the edges. Come back for this big dude. Right, but he didn't die there. And, alright, we're stuck in an office. Not the best. Bleeding heavily. It's okay. Duck up there. Is that the end of the level? I think it is. Full swing. Okay. This is so... I really can't overstate just how brilliant this game is. Now we've got SWAT members coming in. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know what more I can say about it. I feel like the game really does speak for itself. How great and brilliant it is. I need to think of better adjectives than great and brilliant. But it's so hard when you're trying to escape this building as well. I can't believe how many people have guns in this high rise as well. 424, what you got for me? Get away. He can't hurt Paul. He just wants to meet his cousin Greg. Oh no, we're dead. We made it quite far. Only one more floor to go there for that level. You know what, I think I'm going to leave it here on High Rise 2, full swing. Oh, I can't overstate it. Get Ape out. Buy it right now. I don't know what, I think it's on Switch. I think I saw it on the Switch store. Get it on Steam. Get it wherever you can to support this game because it deserves to be supported 100%. It is so, 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 so good. Um, it's adrenaline rushing, uh, gore induced, jazz filled brilliance. It's so good. Uh, I really love it. I hope you enjoyed my video of Ape out. I had such fun making this. So please go ahead and leave a like if you did enjoy it. If you want to see more, we do In The Tub With every Monday. And we also do Let's Plays on the channel. We also live stream three times a week. There's tons of content here for you. I'd be honoured if you could go ahead and subscribe. Got any questions you want to raise? Have you played Ape Out yourself? Is there anything you want to know about the game? And wouldn't multiplayer be fun in this? Um, let, please let me know in the comments below. And I'll make sure I get back to you. Alright? See you!